Saves the World, Tuesdays this fall on ABC. Welcome back to Good Company. I'm out of the studio and on location at the Illinois Eye Center. The Illinois Eye Center has been serving the central Illinois area for over 70 years for routine eye exams and even more complex procedures. There's one problem that's facing 90% of computer and device users. It's called CVS or computer, computer vision syndrome. I'm joined now by Dr. Terry Goodale. He's an optometrist here at Illinois Eye Center and you're going to tell us a little bit about CVS and what it is. That's right. All right, so if I'm not familiar, and I know a lot of people out there aren't as well, what is computer vision syndrome? So computer vision syndrome or uh, digital eye strain is um, some problems or issues that some of our patients face where they are using uh, prolonged use of things like computers, tablets, e-readers, cell phones. And so that places a, a large demand on the visual system and then they can run into certain uh, issues. Um, the average American worker is on the computer for seven hours per day, so that wow. places a lot of demand on the visual system. Absolutely, and I know I spend a lot of time looking at the computer. How do I know if I have CVS? So some of the most common symptoms of, of CVS are um, eye strain, eye fatigue, um, headaches, blurred vision, dry eyes, uh, neck and shoulder pain, um, and a lot of that's due to um, the environment that you're in. If um, you know if the lighting is not proper, if you're having glare off of the screen, uh, if the computer isn't the proper distance from your eyes, um, and also if you're not corrected to the degree that you should be. Absolutely. So maybe you sit at your computer for most of your day. Mm -hmm. What is a way to break that habit of sitting there and maybe get less strain on your mm -hmm. eyes? Yeah, so in fact there, there are some, uh, some rules that they recommend for this sort of thing. So after about two hours of continuous computer use, they recommend taking a 15 minute break to rest your eyes and kind of get back to baseline. Um, another um, guideline that they have is what's called the 20-20-20 rule, where uh, after 20 minutes of computer use, you take a 20 second break to look at something that's 20 feet away. Wow, and does this affect someone that maybe has contacts, glasses, or just without? It, it can be all of the above. Yeah, some, some folks have glasses or contacts, but they're corrected for distance only. And so mm -hmm. they're not corrected for the more, for the near viewing situation. So um, we have to take that into account, make certain adjustments to make sure that they're uh, corrected for the proper computer viewing distance. Um, and so yes. All right, and now if someone is, you know, experiencing CVS, how can an eye doctor help them? Um, so what we do is we do a thorough, a very thorough eye exam. Um, that starts out with a very uh, thorough patient history, so that way we ask a lot of questions to um, see what sort of issues you might be having um, and what sort of work environment you might have. Um, and sometimes that'll kind of tease out some of the issues that you're facing. Um, <clears throat> we also uh, take visual acuities where we measure the vision that you have uh, without glasses and contacts, but also if you come into our office wearing glasses and contacts to see how well you're functioning with those. Um, and then after that, we do a very careful refraction to make sure that everything, um, you know, that your glasses and contacts prescription um, are what they should be for all viewing distances. Um, and then beyond that, we also do um, typically uh, a dilated eye exam where we can check the health of both the front and the back of your eyes so we can make sure that there aren't any medical issues that could mm -hmm. be contributing to the problem. Awesome. So you might have CVS, but it might be something more as well. That's true. Awesome. All right. Yes. And can you tell us those tips again if we think we're experiencing this and when's the right mm -hmm. time to see a doctor? Yeah. So after two hours of uh, continuous computer usage, you want to take a 15 minute break. Um, and then if you're on the computer for 20 minutes, you want to take a 20 second break to look at something at a distance about 20 feet away. Um, and so if you're starting to have any of the symptoms that I had described as far as eye strain, eye fatigue, blurry vision, dry eyes, things like that, you want to consult your eye doctor. All right, all good tips, lots of good advice there. Make sure you, you know, take your breaks when you're sitting at the computer. If you have any questions, you can find them at the Illinois Eye Center. They have two locations. That's 8921 North Woodsage Road in Peoria and 93 East Gate in Washington. Make sure you find them online at IllinoisEyeCenter.com. Thank you so much for uh, telling us about this, and hopefully we can pay a little bit more attention to our computer use. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, we have more good company on the way. Right